Yeah, so today's a kit launch day for British Wheelchair Basketball. Show off all this smart clobber that we've got. Um, well, I started playing basketball back in 2007. I've been involved with the squad since 2013. Um, I had a bit of a sabbatical for a couple of years, but I'm back now, ready for the World Champs. I have been involved for about 16 years now. Um, so I was originally just buying a regular like regular day chair and the coach of my local team happened to be selling me the chair at the time so he invited me along and then I got started from there. What got me into wheelchair basketball, there was a taster session at my secondary school. I went along and tried that and got noticed then by a coach from that and pretty much six months later I'm in the G uh, GB Juniors. It's been really good. We've centralised here at EIS Sheffield all year, so we've been together five days a week, two sessions a day, and uh, we've had we've just come back from a tournament in the Netherlands, so that's been really good to just you know really get some good quality games in. Yeah, there's been some changes, some new faces in. Myself, like I say, I was on a bit of a sabbatical for a few years. I'm back, um, and then there's quite a bit of a younger group coming through, but it's tight. We're like a family. Fantastic, yeah. At Rio Paralympics in 2016, we achieved uh, the women's highest ever ranking of fourth, so I'd probably put that top. Do you know what? The, the men's team have done fantastic for the past like 12, 15 years. Um, we've won three, three medals at the Paralympic Games. Really? We've always been in the top five, top six of the world. Um, European champions, we won three times in a row. Unfortunately, we lost the final last year in Tenerife, but we still made the final again. So yeah, we're one of the best in the world and we're going to go out there and try and win it. Rio was incredible. I think we didn't really know what to expect going in, but just everyone was so friendly, the crowds, the atmosphere and the level of the wheelchair basketball was like nothing I've seen before. Uh, yeah, it's the, the big one, you know, the big dance. We're off to the World Championships next week. Uh, we've been training all year for this. It's in Germany, in Hamburg, and it's absolutely massive for us. So yeah, we're flying out on the 14th. Yeah, we've, we've performed well, and you know, we've been playing against some tough teams, um, but, so it's really pushed us to our limits, but I think we're confident going into Worlds. Can't wait, can't wait. We're in good form, and all the boys are excited to get out there and get the job done. Yeah, we've gone unbeaten in our prep, which is really good, so confidence is high and we're ready to go. Um, I was aware in the fact that we were, as part, we have a leadership group and we were given input as far as, you know, what would we ideally want as far as kit and obviously this fit, fit the bill, so that's, that's it. How happy with it so far? Oh, brilliant, it's so comfortable, it looks great, I don't think we've ever had, ever had a kit as good as this. So, we were obviously asked for our input on everything that was going on, but everything was really quite hush-hush in terms of secrets, not allowed to divulge too much. All I can say is this, the best kit I, I, I've worn and I'm extremely happy with it. Yeah, get following me please. I need some more followers on Instagram. Instagram, TerryBywater07 uh, and Twitter as well, TerryBywater07. Hit me up on Twitter, at Marty26. Follow me on Twitter, it's Lee.Manning14. Um, Check me out on Helen Freeman 7 on Instagram and also Facebook and Twitter. Get me thousands of followers please.